Siena Baseball opens its 2017 season on Friday, and the Saints have been working hard to prepare for the opener. I mean, it's nothing out of the ordinary. It's the same. It's always been, uh, you know, we've got good preparation from our assistant coach. We've done a great job with the guys. The guys are working extremely hard. A very young club, so uh, which is a good thing, I think, right now, because uh, no expectations on their part of what's going on. And, you know, I don't think, uh, you know, in going to UCF is going to intimidate anybody really uh, with the preparation that we've given them. So we're, we're pretty much ready to go. We've been practicing a lot. We've been working really hard. Pitches have been getting lengthened out in the bullpen. Um, we've had some of our guys up to 85, 90 pitches. Um, infielders have been getting a ton of ground balls. Here's has been getting a lot of at-bats. It's been a really good um, preparation season for us this year. Um, we're looking forward to see how you know the freshmen can contribute and how the upperclassmen can keep developing into the players that they are. The Saints will be traveling to Orlando, Florida for the opening series with UCF, and the players are definitely looking forward to the trip. Yeah, we're pumped. I mean, as you can see, we've got two huge storms the last uh, two weeks, so it'll be nice to get down to the warm weather. We've been working really, really hard. Obviously, we're stuck inside for now, so it's going to be nice to get on real grass, throw off real dirt and stuff like that, and just ready to kind of test how much hard work we've been putting in. We can't wait. You know, last year we got to go outside a couple times before we went down because of the weather. Uh, this year we haven't had that luxury, but we really just can't wait. We're getting cabin fever, so it's, it's going to be a welcome change once we play outside. The Saints, who have been to the MAC Championship Series five out of the past six years, say the early season is key to later season conference success. Most schools now are buying into it. I've, I've been doing it since I've been here. Uh, not really worried about wins and losses, kind of treating like a spring training. We've always done it that way, uh, give everybody an opportunity to play, see what they can do. In case we have injuries, we know somebody's going to be able to step right in because they've got some playing time. So, uh, you know, I, I think, uh, and it's helped us as far as the last five or six years, obviously, with the, the being in the MAC tournament, is because there's no in intimidation to get back up here. The when the guys will play, they play hard, uh, and everybody's the same. Yeah, I mean, Coach Rossi does a great job at getting us in front of some really good teams early to get us prepared for our season. UCF is, you know, right on par with a ton of other big southern schools in the country. So it's nice to be able to test our talent against some of the best players in the country and, you know, give ourselves a chance to win a few games. The non-conference season will also help Sienna's young pitching staff prepare for MAC play. We have a lot of young freshman pitchers. Freshmen, our whole staff is basically made up of freshman and sophomore pitchers. So, um, you know, collectively what they do is going to determine uh, how good we're going to be. Because I think offensively we're going to be okay and defensively we'll be adequate. Uh, but the pitchers going to be the name of the game. So, you know, how our returnees, Tommy Miller and Chris Amorosi, do if they can continue to do what they do and we can get some help from our young guys, I think we'll be okay. First pitch of the Saints season is set for 6.30 p.m. on Friday in Orlando against the Knights. For all the latest news on your Saints, follow us on social media and visit us at SiennaSaints.com.